Hey guys, it's Skylar. So today's video is going to be three St. Patrick's Day or Irish cooking and baking kind of treats and I'm so excited to show you guys because they're all so delicious and I've just been eating these like crazy. So yeah, let's just get started with the first thing. So you will need some butter, some confectioner sugar or powdered sugar, cream cheese, vanilla extract, ground cinnamon, and you just want to start out by putting some cream cheese into a cup and you want four ounces of that and then you want to take the butter and you need four tablespoons of that and just put it in a big bowl to start out with. So then just pour some vanilla extract into one teaspoon and just put that in a big bowl. And then you just need 16 ounces of the confectioner sugar or powdered sugar, the same exact thing, just letting you guys know. And then just pour that into the bowl. And then you just want to mix it all up. And it was a little bit hard, so I'd recommend using your hands to do it because my butter was not that soft, but I got it. And then you just want to sprinkle some cinnamon on a plate and basically you just want to take little tiny balls of the mixture and just kind of roll it around in the cinnamon and that will create the Irish potato. And then when you are done, you can just put it on a baking sheet with a pan underneath it. So now for the pretzels with chocolate on it, you're going to need pretzel sticks, some white chocolate chips, and sprinkles if you want. So start out by pouring a bunch of chocolate chips in a bowl and put that in the microwave for one minute and make sure you use a good bowl that is not plastic. Use a glass one. And then just mix up those chocolate chips and they I know so good. So then you basically just want to twist the pretzel sticks around in it and you can go as long as you want it to. I did like a quarter of it and then just sprinkle some of those sprinkles on it and then just rest them on a baking sheet for an hour. So now for the shamrock shake, and this is so good. Um, you're going to be needing the vanilla bean ice cream, some milk, some green food coloring, and peppermint extract. So start out by putting two cups of vanilla ice cream in the blender. And I added more, but you can add whatever your heart desires. So then you need one and one fourth cup of milk and just pour that in. And then you want eight drops of the green food coloring and then add one fourth teaspoons of mint extract and then mix it. That thing where my dad works and we just gave my dad a shower shake and he loved it and now we're walking down to the kitchen again 